just want my food. Or not my food, but the dog treat in my hand. Because you'll never lay by me when I'm just chilling. You only <laughs> lay by me when I've got treats for you. Same time that you follow my instructions when I have a treat, you little jerk. That's Titan for you. Won't hang out with me unless I got a treat. It'd be cool if you, like, chilled with me. Oh, you... <laughs> That's not very cool, man. Not much of a best friend. You use me for my candy. For my dog candy. I, I've given you, like, two of these already. As soon as I give you this, you're going to go somewhere else. You won't hang out with me. Now I have no more. And I got your dog slave all over me. I get a couple, I get a moment of, of chill time with you as a thank you. Then you're going to go walk somewhere else and lay down on the floor. Yep. I guess my time hanging with you is over, huh? No, go ahead. Go ahead. Leave me. I don't care. My feelings won't be hurt. I won't feel used. Oh, you're still laying with me. It's because you're still hoping that I've got something for you. But I don't. The whole world's going to see my fat little arms. What are you doing? There's nothing down there, dude. Now you know there's nothing. And he leaves me. Thanks, jerk. I love you too, Titan. Bye. Well, you better not be searching for a spot of pee. I will kick your butt. Is it Christmas time? Got some jingle bells going on here. Good night, Titan. Hey. Good night, buddy. Good night. I ain't got no more treats for you, so. What's up, guys? I'm chilling here with David. You can't see anything. It's completely dark. But, uh... I just I, I convinced David to take me and Ryan and we just went over to the school and we're sitting here in the dark. David's eating something, ruining the, the ambience. But uh, here let's just listen to it for a second. Isn't that peaceful? So I wanna take this opportunity to discuss the week with you guys. Let you know about some of the the crappy stuff I've been dealing with this week. Uh, let's start with... I found out my job is closing uh, closing my branch. So I applied to get another position. This one will be with Allstate instead of Best Buy. Uh, it's supposed to pay the same. Uh, have roughly the same amount of hours. Uh... But I have a couple different shift options. One would be 10 and a half hours on Saturday and Sunday. Or I can get, that'd be 21 hours. Uh, or I can get 24 hours if I spread it out through the week. Uh, I, I'm thinking of taking the 10, 10 and a half hours Saturday and Sunday each. That way it leaves the week open for me to get another job. Uh, I think I said the pay's the same. But it's still a bummer because I'm going to go two weeks without any fucking... Uh, any work, but then I'm going to have two months of training, which is pretty much full-time every week for two months, and it's paid, so that's forty, almost 40 hours a week uh, at nine fifty an hour, so to me, that's pretty good money right there for two months, right? Sounds pretty yeah, good. that's going to be roughly $1,000 every month. Yep. Minus taxes, of course. <laughs> uh, I say roughly. 
It'll probably be more like $700 a month, unfortunately. We'll see, though. I don't know. Um, so I also am scheduled to work uh, the next 14 days out of the next 15, uh, which is the last two weeks of, uh, of my job. Actually, there's 13 days left now. So the next 12 days out of the next 13. But I'm still going to try and get that 13th day to be... Uh, filled too so I can have as much money as I can to try and take care of the bills yeah turn you guys around hopefully some lightning will strike out there right Ryan how's your week been it's been uh rough uh, not really to be honest um, last week was really rough yeah but uh this week it's just been pretty uh, uneventful yeah I've been um, I've been talking to a lot of people on the internet and um, stuff like that and uh, yeah, pretty much playing some Fallout 4. Don't want to really talk about you know what? Oh uh, what? Oh, you mean my fuck? My, excuse me, my, my fuck. My foster mom dying? Yeah. Oh uh, well, yeah, that happened, and it upsets me, but. It upsets me because, like, like if I have to say, I I probably, like, I probably spent more time with her than I did with my real mom. Like, she was probably, in a way, kind of my real mom. Um, but like, we she she didn't treat me very well at all, and she certainly wasn't very nice to me. And uh, she she used to say things like, "You're never gonna be normal." That you, gotta, you have to just deal with it and you can just give up and stuff like that. She used to say stuff like that all the time and it was so unnecessary. And I hated her and I, I still kind of hate her. But I'm also, I'm really sad that she's gone because it's somebody very, it's somebody so familiar in my life. And now they're just fucking, they're dead just like that. They're gone from my life forever and I'll never be able to see them again. <sighs> have you ever had to deal with anything like that, David? Yep. My grandma on my dad's side. Uh, you remember when we went to Elko? Uh, yeah, with that lawyer guy? Yeah. Uh, my grandma was in the hospital. My dad wanted me to calm down. I dealt with... Uh, the only experience I have uh, firsthand with death was... Uh, uh, two years ago... Uh, well, going on two years, about a year and a half, the whole Madison girl dying in that car crash. Madison. Yeah. Uh, that was probably the, the the hardest thing I've ever had to deal with. I think the next hardest thing I'll have to deal with, at least I hope it's the next. It's kind of messed up to say that. I'm just, what I really mean, though, is I hope there's nothing tragic in between there. But, uh is when my dog passes away when he gets older. But that's not for like 10, 15 years, hopefully, so. And I hope I get to keep him that long, too. What do we say? I don't know if, if you guys can see that, the spotlight in the sky, but it is trippy because it's green. It's white, and then it comes around green. I really wish I had a camera that could would show you just what it looks like on the sky. That's lighting up, like, the whole of the clouds and stuff. The day is coming closer and closer where I'll, where I'll be able to, where my channel will be live again. And so I'm really excited about that. You're getting, uh... I've been trying to lose weight just Your green screen that. kit? Yeah, like, I'm not doing it this month, but, like, I still have a little more, more weight to lose. Uh, like, I'm so close, dude, to, like, losing some, like, the... Well, I mean, I'm still fat. That's the problem. Like, I want to lose the rest of the weight, you know? Well, I guess that's the end of it. David wants to go. So, this will probably be the vlog for the week, because I didn't do too many bit too much this week. It's just been a lot of work, and I've still got a lot of work ahead of me. So, if there's another clip, there's another clip. If not, see you guys on the flip side. My brother's trying to make his car look sexy. We need to mow the yard, huh? Hi, Titan. What's up, bud? I'm on break from work, wanted to go say hi to my brother, and you know, 
Say hi to you, stranger. So hello, stranger. Hey, look, Owen's coming. My brother, my dad is there.